Welcome back to my channel a very warm welcome to you today i'm back with an experimental video this time around um today we'll be making a headband wig out of hair pieces so these are just some of the items no not some all of the items that you'll need of course a headband mesh wig cap sewing kit wig clubs braiding hair and of course velcro so to start off, we're first going to use our mesh wig cap. This is like 12 rand. You can get it at your local beauty store. And of course, a headband. I got this from Checkers for about 30 rand. And now I'm just going to... Actually, I made a mistake here. I'm not going to lie. So what I did, I first put the headband and then the mesh wig cap on top, but inside out. So right here i'm gonna take this thick band and i'm gonna sew it onto the headband i don't know if that makes sense i'll point out which band i'm talking about this band this band right here yes this one i'm gonna sew it into the headband and this is very important you want to make sure that this part is at the back so the next step is basically me taking an old wig of mine and measuring the distance from one wig clip to the other and basically transferring those onto my new wig so i mark these measurements using like a pin you can use anything this step isn't compulsory but basically what i did i got these wig clips from checkers if you can't find the metal ones you can just take this one break it in half take any old piece of cloth and just sew it around this isn't compulsory because the wig band for me was tight enough so I just assumed it would be secure enough so basically this is how you'd sew it on if you were to take this step I would also like to add that when you sew the headband to the mesh cap you only sew from those wig club measurements from the ear to ear tabs you don't sew past the the wig clips okay it's very important so after turning the wig inside it's not inside out now it's the proper way um basically i made sure that the stitching doesn't go through the headband except for that little part but it's okay um because you don't want people to see that it's a headband wig so now I'm going to take the velcro and just basically attach it. So you can stitch it however you like. No one's going to see your stitching. Moving on to the next step, I'm going to take some hair fluid, apply it onto the hair piece. I'm using the expression braiding hair in the color 2. So the hair fluid was basically just to add some shine to the hair. The next step is to crochet the hair. So I insert it, open the hoop, put your braiding hair inside, and then I'm going to close the hoop, pull it through that hole, in order to make like a little I don't know a loop or something yeah a loop then I'm gonna take the braiding hair insert it through that little hoop pull it to make like a little knot if that makes sense and then you should get your final desired look that looks like this at the back you do want to space them out but in front you don't space them out because you want them to look seamless I 
how gorgeous how pretty is his hair like how stunning please moment of truth i'm going to add the wig onto my head <laughs> i'm excited <laughs> Do this if I want to try a new color. Mm. Nah, before I buy it, I go away because the wigs are expensive. Okay, no man, how do you put this on again? Like this, yes, like this. headband wig using hair pieces i've had this idea like in my head but i've never actually entertained it until like youtube recommended a video and i was like shocked that this thing actually it's people are doing this so i was like nah i don't believe it let me try it myself and i tried it i like it a lot i mean <laughs> i actually i don't think this wig is something you can wear for like I don't know for like months on months. I think like a good two weeks would be enough. Okay, so I like this wig. I it's, it's very it's very creative. If it's very out of the box, I think this would be best if you're trying to experiment with colors. If you're trying to try if you're trying to try the the new trend which is the ginger the ginger color wigs now. If you want to see if it's going to suit you, then I'd recommend that you do this before you invest in a wig or permanently dye your hair, just in case you don't like it. But as for long term, I don't think this could work because, yeah, the hair pieces, it can get a little tangle. I mean, if you use expression, then it's not that bad, but if you use other hair pieces, then okay yes guys that's the end of this video please don't forget to like comment subscribe share and then put on your post notification bell until next time bye